it is difficult to know what he looks like today. A hundred days into his hunger strike, Oleg Sensov is said to have lost 17 kilos. His family is greatly concerned for his health. Oleg's condition has severely worsened. He has a very weak pulse of 40 beats per minute. He complains that his heart hurts, that he's weak, and he tries not to get up too often to preserve his strength. He wrote me saying, we should stop telling him that he will be freed soon. He no longer believes it. Sensov was in good health during his trial in 2015 and seemed confident when talking about his situation. I've been in your country for a year. I watch your wonderful television. Your news bulletins are very good. Your propaganda is working very well. A former eSport champion, Sensov released his first film, Gamer, in 2011. Two years later, he joined the Euro Maidan movement, which rejected Moscow's annexation of Crimea. Sensov was arrested by Russian security forces in 2014 and sentenced to 20 years of hard labor for terrorism and arms trafficking. On May 14, 2018, he began his hunger strike. I understand that Oleg does not intend to stop until Ukrainian political prisoners are released. He has the strength of mind to endure the conditions in prison and the hope that his demands will eventually be met. Celebrities such as Johnny Depp and Pedro Almodovar have called for Sensov's release over the past four years. On Friday, French President Emmanuel Macron asked Vladimir Putin to consider a humanitarian solution to the situation. The Kremlin says Sensov cannot be released because he has refused to ask for pardon.